This is C.A. Pazano with Tampa Bay Film. I'm here with Ken Barr and Company. And basically we're at his table at Halloween Horror Picture Show 2015. Hi, Ken, go ahead and introduce yourself. Please. Hi, I'm, hi, I'm, I'm just tired. Yeah, exactly. Hi, I'm Ken Barr. Uh, this is 2015? I thought this was... Hey, I can do that on my own. Anyway, I'm here with a very talented Chelsea Wolf, the star of soon to be major big big time hit, Shadows Fall. Hello, Chelsea. I guess I'm the interviewer now. Exactly, you're the interviewer. Give, it, give us your thoughts on the festival so far. Well, the festival's been going pretty well today. I always love the Wicked Tim Bay Film Festival parties out here. There's a couple of different ones. This one's really nice to see different shorts and features going on with different Halloween horror films. No. Um, my genre that I usually do for acting is more focused on comedy and independent films, so it's kind of nice to expand into something a little different. Very nice. Uh, what are your thoughts on... Um, uh, damn, I'm drawing a blank. You're killing me, Chris. <laughs> this, is, this is improv. Just think on your feet. Oh, okay. So, give me a word that looks like pineapple. Is that, it's, that's improv, right? Well, my question is, is this a short or a feature film? This is a short. I just got lectured on feature films and how I need to get my lazy ass in gear and do one. So, that's next on my calendar, I swear. Big guy that waved a fist at me. We are uh, going to be working on feature soon, but Shadows, for, Sh Shadows Fall is a wonderful theological romp through life, death, and everything that comes in between. Speaking of death, that's the character Chelsea played. Let me get this awesome picture there. We're, we're going to digitally insert that later so it's not a lame print I'm holding up. It's going to be, you know what, we'll do Digitize a square in that hand with the picture, it'll look awesome. But uh, Shadows Fall, theological? Yeah, like I can read that. Can How is it different from other roles you've done, Chelsea? Because you mentioned it was very different from the other type of things you've done. Yes, Chelsea, here. Let me give you the microphone. Well, like I mentioned before, I usually do comedy films, so this was very nice to do something completely out of my element, something where I had to do a nice resting face. Um, a character that usually you wouldn't see me do because I'm usually bubbly, happy, smiley, and a couple of the other films and web series that I'm in. Uh, Relationship Wreck is a web series that I've written and also I'm working on with Lexi Bastery and Stephanie Davis of Bouncy Boxer Media. Um, we've also done uh, short films, Speed Dating, My Great Hell, um, and one of our other comedy, uh, films that will be coming out here soon is called The BS Meeting. So it'll be okay. coming out next month. Um, so those are my films that I've been working on. Yeah, what kind of films have you been doing? And what are you thinking about doing next? That's right, the interviewers, wow. the interviewees interview each other. <laughs> funny, you, funny you should ask that. I am currently in pre-production on Plan 10. What's Plan 10, you say? For anyone that's heard of Ed Wood, Plan 9 from Outer Space, this picks up where that leaves off. What are the aliens up to? How are they going to take over the planet? You'll have to watch and see, because they're up to something, and I know it. Someone's waving a hand. Oh, there's, I have hold a on. In the crowd, I'm, I'm having a hard time discerning you from the rest of the crowd. What's um, my question? Are you going to do like a horror host in Plan 10, kind of like they had Vampira back in the day, kind of be that retro vibe? Are you planning on doing something like that for Plan 10? I am going to go a little different on Plan 10. Okay. We're going to see some spaceships. We're going to see a reporter giving a report that there are no spaceships in, and it's a bunch of nonsense. Here's the hook. The person playing the commander of the alien fleet plays the reporter also. So you see, they've infiltrated already and it's too late. Dun, dun, dun. So that's plan 10. Hopefully we'll get rolling soon. And then, as promised, the feature film from Ken Barr, maybe Chelsea Wolf if available will be there. Who knows? Will she be a light and bubbly death? Who knows? She did take the death rope from the set, so it could appear anywhere. So, why, why, why am I thinking of uh, Bill and Ted's bogus journey? Is that us, you mean? <laughs> well, I don't know. Something is afoot at the Circle K. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first one. The second one, death is... Oh, that's right. That's yeah. in there. They stole that idea from me before I thought of it. Time travel. That's it. It was a, I was back then having a, a slushie at the Circle K, and those Bill and Ted guys caught my whole death routine. Oh, okay. So, yeah, that, that was me. 
The Wheel and Fire invented by Caveman? No, that was me. Uh, it's all me. Or Chelsea. Chelsea. Chelsea too. Yeah. So what else can I, I say? Um, there's so many people here, I'm having a hard time keeping up. I'm getting writer's cramp for all the autographs. So I'm going to get a stamp made and just start stamping. Just stamp that autograph. Or you know what? I'll hire an assistant. There you go. I need an assistant to stamp those autographs for me. So, um, I'm running out of BS to steal, believe it or not. Do you have anything you'd like to have? Well, if you're running out of BS, you can always catch our next short film that I'm in, BS Meeting. There we go. For the Comedy Film Challenge here in Tampa. That will be on November 15th. That was a perfect segue. I know. Thank you very much for that one. That was great. And what is it with all these actors with good speaking voices? You know what I don't You should hear what I'm hearing. Great. Oh yeah. You want me to keep talking? Yeah, you can keep talking. You sound, like you, you sound like you're talking dirty to him now. Chris, you like give me what you're hearing. <laughs> Press one now. Oh no, I, I'm not. I'm not go. I'm not going there. <laughs> you're getting slightly annoyed. Press two now. Um, <laughs> but yeah, it's going great. Hopefully, Florida will start getting onto the ball with the whole film incentives, getting us more work down here. As you can see, it's working already, so we just need to get those incentives so we can get bigger, better projects. So, see, that works. <laughs> In our experiment with the interviewees interviewing each other, I think yes. worked out pretty well. I think awesome. It worked out perfect. Exactly. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. I'll, I'll close this out. <laughs> thank you very much. And uh, with that, without dumping his stuff all over the floor with my XLR cable. <laughs> Go ahead and uh, wrap it. You guys did great. All right, thanks, guys.